It's your boy, back with another one. Guess what? We're reacting to Grandmother Plays Drums. Down with the sickness. I got the Disturbed shirt on. We're gonna rock. Let's go! Can you feel that? Can you feel it? Wah! Wah! Hold on. Pianos and violins are, are just not happening. She said, like, violins and stuff are in the back. All right. Hi. I'm here to play on the worship team. Uh, the organs in the back. Why do they keep thinking she's playing the organ? Disturbed cover band. Alrighty. Oh, sorry, are we being too loud? No, I'm here for the audition for drums. Oh. His reaction was like. You're going to play the drums. Ha <laughs> ha, yeah right lady. Ha <laughs> ha You're here for a noise complaint. That's that's better drumming than I thought would actually happen. I didn't think this girl that when it said grandmother jamming on the drums, I didn't think it would be this sick, this badass, this great. So how come it's not showing any other members of the thing because they can't play the disturb song? I don't know, but uh, so far so good, so great. Uh, she's a uh, a little bit laid back with the drumming, but again, she's playing the damn thing. It changes! Me, it changes! And this video tells me that a lot of people are stereotypical uh, thinking, well, you look like a grandma, you look like a granny, you're not going to be into Disturbed or Metallica, you're not going to be into this stuff, but again, she's jamming, she's playing the song on a nice uh, drum set, great camera angle, great uh, drum sound, um, a lot of people are saying that, a lot of people judge people based upon their appearance, and sometimes you can't tell what someone listens to based upon what they look like, you might look like a metalhead and be a hardcore rap kid, you might be a gangster looking kid, but love to uh, get down in the mosh pits of Disturbed. It is what it is. But it looks like a lot of these people are judging this lady as like, oh, you're just going to be the piano lady. Because that's who you are. You look like a pianist. Nah, she was jamming. Ha, ah, she's jamming. with the sickness. But having the uh, song play over the uh, drums sometimes will mask someone's fall, uh, somebody's not as good playing ability. They will end up being something they're not. And what I mean by something they are not, meaning when they play the drums like this or they play a guitar, right, and they have the music, you won't hear the imperfections. You won't hear the parts where it's a little off or a little uh, out of tune. You won't hear that because you're hearing 
the song for what it is, and the song is a little bit louder than the drums or the guitar or the bass. But again, uh, that's the best way as a musician, if you're not in a band, just put on your favorite uh, record and jam along to it. That's exactly what you're supposed to do, because then it makes you feel like you're in a, a band environment, because as a musician, we should always be playing with other musicians. That's the way you're going to get better as a musician, is playing with other musicians. If you're not playing with other musicians, and you're just always playing by yourself, and you're not doing cover songs or anything, your timing's whack, and your ability to be a good musician is going to fail, because you're going to get bored just playing by yourself so i always recommend people going out and playing out uh at like open mics and doing other things but this grandma's telling that Seems like she's playing a little bit slow compared to, like, what I am hearing, maybe. Um, it could be she's relatively, probably, I'm assuming, not a relatively metal drummer. But who knows? I would love to see some other stuff from her. And one way I know it's more realistic than you think it is, she freaking has in-ear monitors. So she's hearing maybe like a click track in her head when she's playing. So I can sit here and go, yeah, she's, she's, she's doing the damn thing. She's playing her ass off. But overall, the video itself is shot very well. The sound quality overall is pretty good. Was the grandma doing the damn thing? I'll give her respect where respect is deserved. So, again, this is dope. And that was your grandmother. Or the the godmother of drumming okay as it says playing disturbs down so uh with that being said i will talk to you guys in the next one let me know what you guys thought honestly i, I thought it was uh better than uh expected hey everyone my name is dorothea taylor i've been drumming my whole life and every one of these experiences have happened to me throughout my life drummers come in all ages sizes shapes ethnicities and regardless of how good you are, how old you are, we're all still part of a drumming family. So remember, don't judge a drummer or anybody by their looks 
and always, always, always keep sharing your drumming passion to the world. She's absolutely right. For me, all it, basically, I think that's why they made that video of her going into the drum uh, playing. I'm gonna start. I'm gonna play drums, and they're like, "Yeah, you're gonna be the violinist, or you're gonna be something like that, right?" You don't have to look like a metalhead to listen to metal music. You don't have to look like a hip hop dude, like a thug, to listen to rap music. It, it, you don't have to look like a cowboy or a cowgirl to listen to country music. But again, it's a stereotype. People base stuff on a stereotype based upon a book, based upon whatnot. But honestly, it's not about that. It's about, is the music good? Are you good at what you do? And she said she's been drumming her whole life. And she got my respect because if I seen her walking down the street, I would not expect she's the drummer, for one. And I would not expect she's the Disturbed fan or she can play that kind of music. I would just assume she might not even be a musician. And if she was, probably acoustic guitar at best or piano or something. But as always, it's your boy Trevor back with another video, baby. See you guys later. And when I